So since nobody's around, um, the thing that's really bothering me is, you know, that heat stroke really could have caused permanent damage to me. Yes. And, and it could still be hanging on to you. Yeah. And, you know, I don't know if you know this, but Adam, he was using my fishing gear at night and he was going fishing and catching fish, like a lot of fish. And he never shared any of it with me. He would just catch fish with my gear and then eat it. It's not right. No. And well, I like I told them here, like we share everything. I'm honestly a little bit shocked. Even if I was mad at one of my teammates, I would still share with them. I would wake them up in the middle of the night and be like, yo, I got some food for us. If I would have had that nutrients, I really think my body wouldn't have ran down and I wouldn't have had heat stroke. And so I think he caused me to have almost serious damage because of his selfishness. Do you need to have a talk with him about it then? It's something that I'm just gonna stay aware of. Okay. So if you hear me say something, then it's probably I've had enough, you know, okay. I'm putting my foot down. Okay. But it's important I pointed yeah. out because this is something I've had to endure. And, and especially if it's bugging you, like it does, I don't want it to affect you on a survival level either. Well, like, it did. Yeah. It almost, it actually almost, you know, it affected my health. Yeah, I would not be happy about that. And I'm sorry that you've been mistreated like that because that's not fair. Yeah. I don't like that that was done. I feel like that's sneaky. I feel like that's not caring. And so I am keeping that in the back of my brain. And if I did see those kind of behaviors here, I would simply be like, dude, we're a sh we are a sharing family. Like, this is what we do. We don't, we don't take people in the middle of the night. We share. It's just not cool. I know. We gotta just try to keep remembering that we are a naked family.